Hello, hello, hello. We are back 
back again with some more Mass Effect 2 today. We're going to be continuing where we left off on yesterday's stream, which was actually at the end of um, Omega. We finished um, on the Omega station and um, we got a couple of, or a few new members of the uh, squad now actually. Uh, we picked up Zaid, Archangel, which turned out to be Garrus, um, and also Mor uh, Morden, the uh, Solarian. So I've got a uh, few new members of the team, which is pretty awesome. So today we're going to be probably doing a little bit of exploring, um, then I might just go pick up some uh, people too. I'm not 100% not certain what I want to do just at this moment in time. We'll uh, kind of figure that out as we go. So, let's jump into the game. Also, I'm not wearing a hoodie for once. Like, it's a very rare occasion where I'm not wearing a hoodie. But it is really warm today. Um, okay, so... Uh, resume. I don't know why I was thinking there. Like, it's just resume, isn't it? Okay. So, the first thing we need to do, though, is we need to go talk to people. Uh, I was told that I have some unread messages. Let me just click on here quickly. I just want to see... Do we have... No, I don't have a separate thing for Morden. Um, he is a submachine gun and heavy pistol person. Cool. Okay. Um, unread messages. Take care of Garrus. Okay. It's from uh, Nala Butler. I don't know who that is. Uh, Commander Shepard. My husband was one of the... Ah, okay. He was one of the men serving on Garrus's team. I don't know how much Garrus talked, about, uh, talked to you about what happened. I don't know the specifics myself. Only that my husband died in a trap set by those B gangs. I know Garrus blames himself. He took uh, every shot fired at his squad as a failure on his part. And it was clear when he sent me the message about my husband that he thinks it was his fault. My husband would never have wanted that. He was proud of the work he did on Garrus's squad. He was taking back Omega from the gangs. He died fighting with honor. I miss him. God, I'd give anything to get him back. But whatever happened there wasn't Garrus's fault. You're his commander now. Please, if you can, help him stop blaming himself. And please don't tell him th that I sent you this. Thank you. Nala Butler. Okay. Uh, Chief Medical Officer Chokwas. Wow, she's got a long title now. It's not just Dr. Chokwas anymore. Commander. You, can't, you can call me by my name. Come on. I've done further investigation regarding your facial scarring and the old... Ad Ad age, ad age of mind of matter holds true. Negative attitudes and aggressive acts create adverse reactions with your cybernetic implants, while peaceful thoughts and passionate actions promote healing. If you maintain a positive outlook, I believe your facial scarring will heal on its own. Otherwise, there is surgical equipment we could use to insulate, insulate your cybernetic implants and accelerate your healing, regardless of your mental outlook. I've updated plans for the new medical equipment to your research terminal in the tech lab. Basically, you can make your face glow red <laughs> if, you, uh, if you're mean. But we're not mean, so it doesn't really matter. Um, but you can also just negate that using upgrades anyway. Um, okay. That is everything in there. Okay, let's talk to Kelly first. Morden's psych profile warned of hyper behavior, but he is like a hamster on coffee. He's going to be a very productive member of the team. Anyway, what's up? How's the crew? Is there anything I should know? Nothing right now. Nothing. Commander. Okay, well, I'm going to have to talk to everyone else then. Do you have a moment to talk? I always have time for you, Commander. Uh, okay. I better go. Okay. Maybe we'll talk later. Let's go talk to Joker first. He's always our first portal call when we come back from a mission. Hadley, you heard about Garris Fields. Any news on your brother? Gone. They're all gone. But we'll get them back. Shepard and Lawson are on it. We'll get your brother back. And make sure the collectors pay for taking them. Oh my. Okay. Well, yeah, we... It's been made personal to our uh, team. Oh, wow. Uh, how does Joker see like this, though? I guess Joker doesn't actually use Windows, does he? To see where Binary he's going. Clear. Let's open that back up. Fair enough. Okay, Joker. Oh. Commander. I assume everything is going well up here. It was until the thing started questioning my every move. It won't let anything slide. You were deliberately falsifying maintenance reports, Mr. <laughs> Not falsifying, tweaking. I always round up on task times. It makes us look good when we come in under. Harmless. Harmless self-promotion. Edie can ease off on that. 
Very well, Shepard. Yeah, go pout. I win. Joe. <laughs> right, right. No hard feelings. Good game. I assume everything is going well up here. Good for now. Fractured my thumb on the mute, but I think I made my point. I assume everything is going well up here. Good for now. Fractured my thumb on the mute. <laughs> That's it for now. See you, Commander. Yes, Shepard. Yeah. Can we talk about you? Yeah. Do you have about a specific you? inquiry? Nah. Logging you out, Shepard. We'll come back to that later, I guess. Okay, well. We do have a new area to explore now. Excuse me. Because we did get modern right at the end of last time. So, um. Got a whole area to explore with him. Commander, can I help you with something? Normandy upgrades. Oh, okay. I'm more interested in just talking for a bit. If you want, Commander. Cerberus has ranks, but it's not the Alliance. No rules about fraternization. That's not what this your is about. Your call. You want to get friendly with everyone? That's your business. Oh, everyone, yes. Relax, Jacob. I'm just interested in what makes you tick. Anyone else said that, I'd walk away. Most Cerberus people try to play like the elusive man, hiding bullshit behind a smile. But you? I like what I've seen. I'll give you a shot. What do you cool. want to know? Any family? Anyone waiting for you back home? Only child and no extended family. Never settled down. Didn't seem fair with this job. But you can't miss what you never had. Fair enough. You seem quick. You seem okay with taking a risk on me. Why? Soldiers like us know how important trust is to the crew. I'm not used to seeing it on a Cerberus ship. Definitely not from people they put in command. <laughs> focus on more than the job. A threat this big, you can't just throw people at it blind. They need inspiration. The job is everything. There's a lot riding on this. But we can't give up everything. Not always a choice we get to make. Good to try, though. I gave it my best back in the Alliance. Got labeled a troublemaker. Oh dear. <laughs> they were always on the lookout for disruptive types. Cerberus isn't any better. They just put more effort into hiding how much they spy on you. We got nothing to Don't hide. Watch. We're not hiding anything. Wouldn't matter if we were. It's not like they can reel us in. We're handling this, whether they like it or not. Anyway, we should get back to prep. Nice talking to you, Shepard. Let's do it again sometime. We will. Right now. <laughs> Commander, can I help you with something? Talk? I'm more interested in just talking for a bit. Already? Okay. I'm not big on forcing these uh, talks, Thoughts Shepard. on mission? Let's do this. How are we doing, Jacob? What's your sense of the mission? If Morden's modifications hold up, we've got a shot. If they don't, we're dead. Seems like that was always a strong possibility, though. Yes. Anything else, Commander? Opinion? What do you think of the state of the crew? Well, we don't have a full complement. We don't stand anything Yeah, he says the same thing. I guess he'll say the same thing until we do have a full complement. So we'll hold off on that one until we uh, have a full complement. against the Collectors? They spec this ship to the original Normandy, but you were there. The Collectors cut her like butter. This armor just isn't top of the line anymore. People will die if we don't upgrade. Alliance had some new toys in Secret Dead before I left. I could try and pull a few favors. Yes, please. Um... Okay. Wait, these are... This isn't Normandy upgrades, that's my upgrades. Um, ship enhancements, this is what I wanted. Oh. Oh, I need... Oh, I'm so close! <laughs> uh, and then... Oh, we're nowhere near that. that. Oh, yeah, this one uses platinum. Okay, that's fine. We can work towards them. What are these prototypes? Whoa. I am gonna... I am aiming to do all of these things, to be fair, but... Let's do weapon upgrades first. Get assault rifle. Really? Complete any research project in the moment of the app. Oh wait, am I? Oh, I don't have to do those with Jacob. I can do them in. Okay, it's probably better to do them in here with Morden. Um, ED? Where are you? Where's ED? There she is. What's this area of the ship? This is the Normandy's technical lab. Where you can investigate hmm. I don't know why I'm trying to look around the corner. Ship or team performance. All upgrades can be developed in the Normandy's lab, provided yep. you have acquired the necessary resources. Mm -hmm. you can find these resources by scanning planets or searching while on missions. Yep. Uh, ship enhancements. Wait, I need. How do I get the. the isn't there a. Hmm. How do you get more... No, there's a way. How do you get a higher capacity of probes? Okay, never mind. 
We'll talk to Morden. How can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Of course. Plague on Omega dealt with plenty of time to analyze collector intelligence. Impressive laboratory setup. Missed working for operations with a budget. AI in particular. Very helpful. Best setup I've seen since work with Special Tasks Group. Good. Um, any word from you? Is your assistant hmm? Daniel settling in all right? Quite well. Safe and secure. Neighborhood good, mostly good. quiet with Plague gone. Left him the security mechs just in case. <laughs> Careful. Also tired of mechs. Noisy. Never used them in STG. Investigate. It must have been frustrating working on Omega with such a limited facility. No. Loved it. Limited facility presents challenge. Save greatest number of people using limited resources. <laughs> security threats, gangs, oh, mercenary this guy's crazy. add additional difficulty. Quite enjoyable. Plague stretched abilities to limit. Couldn't have asked for more. Also, enjoy saving people, of course. Helping the helpless, greater good, all that too. Nice. Retirement after SDG work complete. Fair enough. Tell me more about the Solarian Special Task Group. Respected organization. Clandestine. Handles difficult assignments with limited oversight. Recon, analysis, what? occasional you know. rep work. Identify We're problems, talking. have Get neutralization up. options ready should need arise. Model for Council Spectres based on Special Tasks Group. Very similar. Fair enough. Similar in what way? Salarians lack numbers. Brute strength, military prowess, have to rely upon stealth, intelligence. Agents trusted, given wide operative freedom. Spectres similar, given goals. Makes sense. Told to accomplish. Better, funded, of course. <laughs> Didn't have to buy our own weapons. Hey, what? I had to buy all my own stuff. You said you were in the special tasks group. What kind of research were you doing? Not simply research. Several recon missions. Covert, high risk, served under young captain named Kirihi. Kirihi! Krogan genophage, took water, tissue samples from... We met Kirihi. I worked with an SDG captain named Kirihi. His team helped me destroy Saren's cloning facility on Vermeer. Heard he was part of that. Jury rigged explosive. <laughs> Always got job done with limited resources. Good captain. He and was. Chloe Hold the line. Loved his speeches. <laughs> there we go. Line. There it is. to get job done and go home. <laughs> military bravado. Jargon. Chest pounding. Uh, no offense. Why would STG study the genophage? Crawford oh, like Rebellion's that. bloody. Dangerous. Nearly I think we meet him again. Attacks. I'm pretty certain we meet him again at some point. Adapt. Mutate. If I don't know whether that's in three, though. It might be in prepared. number three. What was the STG preparing to do? Military schematics for likely Krogan population growth. Political scenarios for attack points. Genophage reduced Krogan numbers. Species aggression unchecked. Population explosion would be disastrous. STG helped check Krogan rebellions. Needed to be ready to do the same. Simple recon. Nothing to worry about. What can you tell me about the genophage? Bioweapon designed by Solarian science team. Deployed by Turians against Krogans to end Krogan rebellions more than a thousand years ago. Affects every cell of Krogan body. Commonly and incorrectly considered a sterility plague. Actually adjusts viable fertility rates to compensate for high Krogan birth rate. Stabilizes to pre-industrial population growth levels. Nice talk. Okay. <laughs> Should get back to work. Need to study. So much data. Here if you need me. Okay. Um, let's talk to him again. Shepard. How can I help? Yeah, okay, because we, yeah, we need to do these. Is the lab working well for you? Quite satisfactory. Found a few surveillance bugs. Destroyed most of them. Returned expensive one to Miranda. Nothing <laughs> unexpected. Just need more samples. More collector data, tissue samples, anything you can get, I can use. Find new tech. Okay. Uh, squad. Are there any medical concerns I should be aware of on the team? Cerberus personnel in excellent condition. No squad concerns to report. Always some matters, but nothing affecting immediate mission. Cool. Any Upgrades. ideas on other ways to prepare for the collectors? Ideas, yes. Expensive, but possibly valuable. Can show you. Hmm. This is... Oh, he is... Oh, more than Omnitool. He wants, an, he wants a new Omnitool. Fine, more than you can have an Omnitool. Okay. Uh, let's do this. Okay, it's a bit annoying that we have to go in and out of it. Okay, so we can't do any more in there. Armor, med gel capacity. Oh. Uh, interesting. Got a new thing for tech damage. We'll keep going with everything, like working our way down the list until we run out of uh, uh, resources. Especially these armors, this is kind of almost silly to do, but oh well. 
Okay, we need more resources to do more. Okay, which probably leads us into a good place for when we, uh, when we when, once we finish talking to everyone, we will uh, start collecting more resources, I guess. Oh, you know what I forgot to do, actually? Um, I forgot to... Um, we didn't get any new ships. There's still no hamster or fish. Um... What was I saying? I forgot to check out which weapons are best. Um, I'll try and remember to do that tomorrow. Another colony's gone missing. Oh no. Ferris Fields, I heard. Oh yes. The That's one we heard about earlier. Canton. Did your family get back to Earth? Not yet. Our mother in law's given us grief. No doubt. Operative Lawson assures me the transport team will physically drag them away if need be. Fair enough. Well, I hope they, I hope they're okay. Um, I don't think there's any point talking to uh, Doctor Chocolate anymore. Commander, I very much enjoyed sharing Never mind, nice there brandy is. with you, but I hope I wasn't too unprofessional. Brandy goes straight to my head. I enjoyed it's it. Nice to see you let your hair down. Guess I hadn't realized how much those feelings needed airing. But I didn't give you much of a chance to vent. So tell me now. What do you think? Everyone's depending on us. We won't let them down. They just don't make them like you anymore, Shepard. Well, promise me we'll share a bottle every year. The next one is on me. Okay, we will. I promise. How may I help you, Commander? Odds? There's a very good chance this mission will I've be been through the... We s I've lived okay. I'll see you I didn't know whether that was actually going to be different or not. It wasn't. Okay. Well, so we still don't have... Another colony went missing. Ferris Fields. Ferris Fields? Didn't Hadley have a brother stationed there? Yeah. He's taking it pretty hard. I uh, still haven't got the food for him yet, so there's no point talking to him just yet. Um, but we might as well... Go speak to Garrus. Shepard, need me for something? Um, I just wanted to talk. Have you got a minute? Can it wait? Nope, for a bit? he's calibrating. Calibration. <laughs> okay. Um, upgrades. Have you got any upgrade ideas for the Normandy's weapon systems? A few, yeah. Here, take a look. Okay. Still can't afford it. Okay. Let me know when you've got the materials for me to upgrade our guns. Will do. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. Garrus didn't want to talk. How rude. Miranda, do you want to talk? Got any up upgrade suggestions as well? Commander, talk? What can I do for you? You have a minute, Miranda? There's a lot to do, Shepard. Nope. Maybe another time. Upgrades? Have you got any ideas for potential upgrades we could make? A few ideas, yeah. Yeah, take a look. A ship enhancement. Ooh. This. Huh. It doesn't add any uh, um, probes, but it makes it quicker, which is obviously a good thing. But I uh, don't have enough resources, resources for you. Let me know. I'll let you work. Of course, Commander. Yeah, it looks like people don't really want to talk too much. Not too much talking at the moment. Um, we'll go down, we'll see if uh, Zaid wants to talk and see if he has any... Oh no, he probably doesn't have any upgrade options, does he? Because he's DLC. He doesn't actually have a proper conversation. Oh. Hey, don't touch. Don't run. Yeah, we're not going through all that again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We, we're not doing that all over again. Yes, yes, we know. We heard all about it. Oh my god. Shh. I can still hear him as if I'm next to him. Give up every weapon I own for one more mission. Yes, 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 yes. We know, we know, we know. I didn't want to actually hear about it. This mission takes me back. This is what we wanted. Get a knife stuck in the right way, and you can pull that plate right off a Krogan's head. It's the best way to get a Krogan to talk. The threat of it drives him mad. Okay. <laughs> Me and a buddy were hard to take out this one guy, Matthias, I think. Hell, I forget. 
Turns out it was a trap. We got jumped by a hit squad. Two Batarians, a Krogan, and a Hannah. That a Hannah? fish nearly choked me to death. Wore a neck brace for weeks to cover that up. Haven't underestimated a Hannah since. Fair enough. I should let you go. Talk more later, Captain. Okay. Do these two want to have a chat or a... Everyone's talking about this. Everyone's gone. Shit. We're going to make those dirty buggers pay. <laughs> what can we do for you, Commander? Carry on. Will do, Commander. I'm assuming she doesn't. Oh. What can we do talking to one talks to both. Okay. Do, Interesting. Let's go downstairs. I'm stuck on a nothing. Hamster? Are you down here? Space hamster. Come on, where are you? No. No space hamster. I'm sure there's a... I'm sure that's a thing. I'm sure there's a space hamster down there. Okay. Let us go... Start exploring. Kelly, you got any information for me? No? Okay. Okay, so let's go refuel. Oh, I can have more probes. It just didn't stock me properly. We also need fuel. Really? I... Yeah, that was weird. Okay. Let's go back to this planet. And resume our scans. Okay. A bit annoying how you have to do it. I didn't mean to click that. We got a little bit of stuff. Oh, there's a lot of palladium there. Okay, it's poor now. I want to make it none though, that's what, what's the aim. Get a lot of platinum here as well, I guess. Hmm. A little bit of stuff there, but not not a major amount. Not like this. I can now afford the collector chitin armor. Is it chitin? No, chitin, isn't it? It's not chitin, it's chitin. I always forget that. That's a weird way of pronouncing it. Oh, hello. Grab that. It's nice it, that it tells me, like, when I've got enough stuff to afford something, because it means I know, oh, I can go back to the uh, research thing. Okay, we've depleted it. Okay. Which means we can... Oh. Let's forget, you can't actually exit that way. You have to always click this. Okay, well, while we're here, we might as always restock the probes. Okay, let's go over to this planet here. Got moderate on this planet. Probe away.
Woohoo! A lot of platinum there. I actually really like doing this uh, scanning of planets and probing it. Ugh, such a cool like thing to do. So uh, I do apologize, but we will be doing a lot of this. <laughs> we'll, we will spend a lot of time scanning and probing planets. One of those things I like doing. Okay, we knocked it down to poor. I will stop every time it says depleted though. I know technically when it says depleted, you can actually still find more, but I'll just I'll just go until it says depleted because it's hard to find anything when it says depleted. It's just there's, there can be some, but I'm not gonna like spend that, like too much time looking for it even on depleted planets. Oh, nice chunk of platinum there. So the different, they, I think the different elements actually give you different noises when they are uh, getting higher. Away. This might deplete it actually. Yeah. Cool. Go buy some more probes. Probe. This one's rich. This has got a lot of stuff on it. A lot of resources on here. Hello. A lot of palladium there. And that cloud. Heavy ship armor. Ooh, nice. Okay. Ship upgrades. I always like them. Kind of my plan is to, like, do all the planets in a system, check out the upgrades, see what I can do, then move on to the next area. That kind of thing. They're, like, constantly upgrading. Down to good now. I think it's rich, good, moderate, poor, depleted. I think that's kind of the ordering for it.
We're good on platinum. We've got quite a lot of platinum at the moment. Nearly 20,000 platinum. Obviously, some of the upgrade stuff costs like... Well, what, I know one of them costs 50,000 something or other. So, we still don't actually have that much. Excuse me. Also, if you couldn't tell, Element Zero is a little bit rare. Um, it's only found in certain, like, planets. Whereas the other three are found on most planets. Moderate. This planet's got a lot of platinum on it, apparently. Sometimes you, if you, like, if you do it right, or, well, in some cases, I, I shouldn't say do it right, but sometimes you can jump straight from moderate to depleted if you if you get a big chunk. Like this could technically jump us from moderate to depleted. No, nope, we, we went to poor. We're, we're probably low. We are probably close to depleting. We've almost gone all the way around the planet as well, to be fair. We found almost all of the uh, main pockets of stuff. I also don't think there's a limit to how much you can carry. I know the platinum says it's full, but I think we can just still ca carry on collecting it anyway. I think. I don't think there's an upper limit. Okay, where's... Oh, I don't... Does that last ring... That last ring is the mass relay, isn't it? The mass relay counts as a ring. Okay. Cool. Well, we've got some other places to go. However, we will... Like I say, we will... Every time we finish a, like, a, uh, a system, we will check the upgrades. Work our way down. What does this even do? Heals your squad to full health. Um, ship enhancements. We've got some ship armor, which is good. Ship upgrades make uh, the final mission uh, more likely to succeed without um, injury. I think that's everything we can do anyway. Yeah, okay. Let's go back to exploring. No messages for you, Commander. I know. <laughs> we haven't done anything yet. Okay, let's go to Batala. Butter. This is what you need fuel for. I can't actually remember what happens if you run out of fuel. You do have to be careful. Um, yeah, let's start with the closest one in and then work our way out. This one's moderate. It's a very black planet. Or like purpley dark colour. Pretty cool. Looks like it's oily. Whoa. Oh, hello. Hello. Some platinum there. We used a lot of platinum when we were doing those upgrades. We actually used a lot of pal uh, palladium, palladium as well. If you keep seeing me look up, it's because I got the Champions League final on the uh, on my TV as well. I'm just checking in on it. Oh, I can get the cannon now. I guess I needed iridium. Launching probe. Launching 
launching probe. Whoa! I love it when it jumps up like, like that. Probe. That's a lot of stuff there. You can get the the chitin armor again because we didn't get it last time. Wow, this planet's full of palladium. <laughs> I just keep getting a little spikes of iridium. Oh, it's depleted. The one issue um, I have is I have because I use up so many probes. I have to go back to the uh, place. I spend a lot of money on this stuff because I've only got fourteen probes, and we've still got another planet to do. So I'm gonna have to go back to the uh, Omega system, whatever it is, because I'm not gonna be able to have. An, I'm not gonna have enough probes. Oh, oh, there's element zero on this planet. Probe launched. In research projects. Element Zero is used for bio-amp and omni-tool upgrades, which allow squad members who have biotic and tech powers to be much more effective. Good to know. Thanks, Edie. Launching probe. Probe launched. More element zero. Probe away. Probe launched. Oh, look at that. Two massive Probe peaks. Launched. I've only got three pro probes left, so we might have to come back to this planet. Unless this can drop it down a lot. Yeah, we're probably going to be coming back here when we've got some more uh, probes. That's not going to drop it down to the depleted. Only got one probe left. Okay. Yeah, that's one of the annoying things. Is uh, I don't, I don't actually know if there is a um, an upgrade for the probes. I, I the only reason I thought there was is because um, I only had ten before, and I knew there was definitely more than ten that you could carry at once. Why is it so slow to buy stuff? Okay. Might as well just go out this side, I guess. <laughs> it's quicker. Okay, back to the same planet. Oh, a long name for a planet as well. Okay, uh, where did we... Oh, it's actually put us back to where we were, so that's good. Launched. 
Got a bit, bit of element zero in there as well. Ooh, hello. Still moderate, apparently. Okay, might as well grab the element zero from here and we'll go back over to the right a little bit to get the uh, palladium. Or not. There's not actually that much there. Yeah, fair enough. There's a, there's a little bit. It's poor. It will be depleted soon. We've only got... We're very close to a, going all the way around the planet, so this will probably see us to poor anyway. Uh, to depleted. No? Okay, there's a chunk somewhere that I've missed. This does sometimes happen, especially when I'm running out of probes, because I often like only go for the the major amounts. I didn't mean to click that. I hit my cup. Eh, at least I got something. Come on, where is it? Where's the bit I missed? Yeah, we'll do that. Just, just get a little bit. See if that helps. Sometimes it's not actually that much you've missed. You're like very close to making it depleted. Here we go. It's probably this bit. It's probably see us depleted. No, there's more. Okay. Oh, hello. What was that? I missed that. There we go. This will be it. Surely this is it. Yeah. Okay, we've got 20 probes left for the. Final planet of this area. Start scan. Launching probe. <coughs> probe away. This one's already poor, so there's not actually that much on this planet. Whoops. <laughs> Accidentally let go of the button. Oh, hello. <laughs> There's a load of element zero there. I'm only getting little spikes at the moment. We've got over 30,000 platinum now, which is nice. And we're going to get a little bit more here as well. Still not depleted though. We must have been like high poor, like poor but on the high end of poor. Like only just into the uh, poor category. There is some palladium right here as well. Maybe not. Maybe there wasn't actually that much. Okay. Um, well, let's... We finish this area again, so let us check the researchers. Okay, so... Speeds up the planet scanning process. Okay, we'll see how this works. See, see how well that actually does. And we can get better cannons. And we can get the chitin armor. And that's it for now.
and then we'll go to another area. Okay, we will go back to the uh, the main area first, though. The um, to uh, just let you know, it's always the place that has the mass relay that's got the uh, fuel station. So if you are in need of getting some more probes or fuel and you can't remember where you came from, just head back to the mass relay and you'll find it. Okay. We're going to work our way around like that, so we'll go over to uh, Father first. I think there's a mission over here as well, actually, if I remember correctly. I have detected an anomaly. Yeah. So I'm going to do, find this anomaly first. Basically, it's... You see there's a white line on the uh, scanner thing? There you go. We'll uh, then do a scan for the uh, minerals afterwards. Normally detected signal scans detected a transmitter matching Cerberus encryption. It is reg registered to an unknown deep cover operative. Cerberus operative life signs unconfirmed. Other transmissions that match known eclipse coded communications also detected. Let's land. Let's go for it. Um, I'm thinking we go Garrus and Morden for this one because I haven't used Morden yet and I like Garrus. Um, I've got four points to use. Shall I get this? So then that's complete. Yeah, combat master. Um, ooh. Oh, cool. Okay. Okay. Uh, weapon damage. Uh, what's this one? Dash 9%. I'd rather have probably commando. Yeah, commando. That's what I went for last time as well. Evolve any power. Oh, wait. You can evolve all of these? Oh, interesting. Okay. Morden. Uh, we will auto. Garrus. Auto. Cool. Uh, Shepherd. We have got... Um, collector assault rifle. I don't like it. I don't like the collector assault rifle, to be honest. I actually don't really like the... Uh, Geth... Um, uh, assault, uh, shotgun either. Because it's like... You have to charge it up and stuff. Uh, yeah, well, that's the one we want to use anyway. Okay, cool. Let's find out what's going on here. Okay. We don't know what we're up against yet, but... Uh, oh, no. I'm the only one who has... Ammo. Changes anyway. Um, let's get you using your machine pistol. Garrus, you're going to use a sniper rifle. You got it. Switch up. Yes. Cool. Let's move out, or move in, or whatever. We've been spotted. <laughs> ah. Impressive. Enjoy. Okay, so we now know we are against One down. Uh, organics. Hey! So, incendiary is good for organics. One less to worry about. <laughs> she died as well. She had, her death was so funny just then. Okay. Let's do a little explore, see what we can find here. I don't know what I just opened, to be honest. Some holding thing. Oh, it's for credits. Are we under attack? Oh, yeah, we are. Okay, my shield's back. Uh -huh. What is that? That was weird looking. But cool as well. 
She's on fire. I don't know what's good against armor. I think incendiary is good against armor. Okay. Access logs. Okay. C Cerberus agent Tyrone Rawlings. Eclipse targeted agent Rawlings some time ago. We know Rawlings is connected to the encrypted data we acquired. The data could conclusively prove Cerberus's involvement in the Arachni experiments. We believe Rawlings possesses a cipher that can be used to decrypt the data without this this his cipher the data could take years for eclipse to decode uh, agent rawlings proved difficult to capture having uh, insinuated himself insinuated himself on a ship bound for the atrocan traverse he had won over the loyalty of the ship's crew who believed him to be a human dignitary on a mission of discovery our own agents managed to disable the ship and ho hobble hobble its defense is long enough to extract agent rawlings we lost a lot of men to obtain this asset this data had better be worth the expense the interrogation has failed despite some of our most advanced interrogation techniques agent rawlings managed to evade our questions when we applied more invasive methods he proved resistant to those as well eventually agent rawlings resistance caused tempers to flare we consider it unfortunate that agent rawlings did not live to pass on the decipher oh dear we have men working to decipher the encryption now as long as we control this data it's mere it's mere existence remains a powerful tool against cerberus okay well they haven't cracked it yet then i i take it Got some extra money. We actually got a job from that one. Normally we get credits because we're uh, always maxed out on the uh, Medigel, but I think I, I just upgraded the amount I can carry, didn't I? So I hadn't refilled from that. Uh, which is the right way? That's the right way, apparently. So what's out here? Just some uh, platinum. Cool. We're in. I guess this is Agent Rawlings. Showing our allegiance. Data uploaded to Alliance Command. The elusive man's not gonna like that. Complete a mission discovered by scanning an unexplored world. I bumped into Zaid oh. recently. Wait. Quite the character. Given how much violence and I didn't actually know she was gonna say anything. Surprisingly well adjusted. Still, I wouldn't want to be alone with them. Anyway, Goodbye. what's up? That'll be all. I'll be here. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Mm, not yet. It's probably from the Elusive Man. Or the Alliance, I guess it could be. Let's go back to Lorik. Okay, start a scan. Let's do a uh, resource, uh, resource scan. It's rich as well. Rich in platinum, apparently. Very rich in platinum. Platinum seems to be the uh, the resource that we find the most of. It's the most common one, apparently. It's one we've always got a lot of. I actually got a lot of element zero now as well, to be fair. Probe 
broke away. Probe launched. I do, I, I, I do think there is a, if, if memory serves me correctly, I'm pretty sure there is a probe upgrade and you can get to 60 probes, I think it is, if I remember correctly. I, I like I say, I don't know for definite, but I, I do seem to remember having more probes than this. Could be wrong. Let's do that, get those two a little bit. Oh, good show going a palladium there. Okay, depleted. We've only got 11 probes left, so um, it might be best to... Eh, actually, we will. We'll do this first. We'll use our 11 here. Probe launched. Hmm. Chelsea have just won at the Champions League. Where are the big chunks? There's one. We've got loads of platinum again now, it's awesome. I'm just trying to find the big chunks because I've got so little probes. Oh, or semi big ones, I guess. Hello. Oh, so close to getting 20,000 on the uh, iridium there. Question is, can I deplete it with this one probe? Probably not, because it's still on moderate anyway. It's still on moderate after that. Okay. So go get the uh, some more probes. So clunky. Okay. 
Oh, hello. Straight into the iridium there. That gets it down to poor. but might as well do it okay, I have actually gone all the way around but to be fair I wasn't doing all of the I probably did miss some stuff because I was being very selective where, where I was searching because I had so few probes another look around See if we can't find some decent sized deposits. Yeah, like this one. Not much in it, but I might as well do it. Still more. Can't be much more. We must be getting close to getting it all now. Oh, hello. Here we go. This might deplete it. Okay, got 21 probes for the last one. Which is not too bad. Should be able to get everything we can on this planet. This one's rich. Nearly at 40,000 plat platinum, which is pretty nice. Too far, I'm nearly at 30,000 on uh, Iridium and uh, Palladium as well. Probe away. Probe away. This should probably see us over 40,000. It did. Ooh. We're still rich as well. There's still lots on this planet, apparently. Hmm. There's the highest peak there. Yeah, there's 30,000. The only one that's not above 30,000 now is uh, Element Zero, but it's always quite hard to get Ele Element Zero because it's only on specific planets. Like I said before. Oh, hello. Palladium is uh, kind of, sort of, catching up with the uh, Platinum. Only 10,000 off now. This planet is still rich as well. It's still got a lot of um, resources on here. Okay, now it's not catching up anymore. That was a big jump up from the Platinum. <laughs> There is a fly in my room now. I should probably close my window. It's just, it's been so warm today. Getting close to 50,000 now for the uh, Platinum. Just as I was saying that Palladium was uh, catching up as well. Did we miss out good? Did we go straight from rich to moderate? <laughs> 
Ooh, medbay upgrade. So yeah, we went from Palladium getting close to 10,000 uh, to Platinum, so now Platinum's 20,000 ahead now. <laughs> yeah, and there we go. It's depleted. Oh, perfect. Used up all my probes as well. Let me just close my window. Don't want anything else flying in here. One fly is enough. Okay, let's get out of here. And that was the last planet in this little system so i'm gonna do some researching one of them might be the med bay if there's nothing before it that i don't know whether we actually were notified about anything else oh yes the avalanche as well cool Okay, so. Hey, what? I don't know how I just did that. Stock up again, and then we will he head over to Amada. Normandy crash site is over here as well. Over there. But we'll go here first. There's a few plants in this area. Oh, look how little platinum we've got now because of that. I spent it all. Get out of here, fly. Get out of here. Away. Try and build up my platinum again. Use ten probes on a planet that is poor on resources. How? How is this possible? Launching probe. There we go. Okay. Go to this one. This one's got moderate resources. No, mine is now poor. After one probe. Probe launched. Probe away. It's definitely on the low end of the moderate. Away. 
launching probe. Probe launched. Launching probe. Oh, hello. There we go. Probe launched. More platinum. Ten probes remaining. Yeah, we'll do it. Probe Just launched. a little bit in there. Probe launched. Probe. Probe away. There it is depleted. Um, I think rather than starting the next one with only six probes, I will just go grab some more probes because there's no point. <laughs> I'm not going to get very much out of six probes. I'm nowhere near where I wanted to be. Okay. It's a good start. Probe launched. Oh, element zero on this one. Probe away. It's a very green planet. Oh, hello. <laughs> the other two were high and then this one jumped up above them. Of iridium, iridium, iridium. Sorry, I can't speak. Oh, hello. It's always nice when you like just click the scan button and it just like jumps up like that. Decent amount of everything apart from iridium. Probe launched. Probe away. Go down to pour. Launching probe. Launched. 
Getting close to 50,000 on the uh, Palladium. Okay, we're finished on this planet. How many probes have we got? Wait, how many probes have we got? 12 probes. Okay, I'm going to uh, go buy some more probes again. Because I'm going to need more than that. Trying to think what the... If I finish a planet with less than 15 probes, should we say 15? I'll go back and buy more probes. I think that's probably the, the best way to do it. Obviously, might as well buy more fuel while I'm here. Why? Fuel is so weird. Sometimes it just like fills up without me clicking it, and sometimes it doesn't. Sometimes it doesn't fill up at all even when I'm trying to click it. Okay, next planet is actually the um, one with the Normandy crash site on it. Anomaly detected. Let's do the anomaly first. There's a little bit of platinum there as well. On our sensors. Anomaly detected. Scans confirm the wreckage of SSV Normandy on the planet's surface. No life signs or mechanical activity detected. Stable landing zone located amid the crash site. Let's go down. There it is. The Normandy. The original. Or, well, what's left of it. I don't even know if you bring a team with this one. I think it's just me. Because there's no fighting on this planet or anything. This is just exploration. can put that away we don't need that not right now anyway okay there's 20 dog tags to a why can't i use a map okay i guess there's no map for this place no map why weird okay 20 dog tags to find and a monument to place down as well which i'm thinking we will place in here to be honest Oh no, actually, I want to place the monument next to where it says Normandy, I think. Actually, instead of in here. It doesn't matter. I don't think it, like anything really affects what, like where you place it. But I'm not placing it there. I want to place it where it says Normandy, which I think is over that way. Why did he get his weapon out? I didn't tell him to do that. <laughs> Wait, does double tapping spacebar do that? No, okay. Because that's what I clicked, I double tapped the spacebar. I think each one of those crates has got a tag in it. Oh, what did it say I could open? Where? Oh, down there. I was like, where is this thing that I can open? There's the Mako. I'm not placing a monument there, that's just weird. Weird place for a monument. Oh, data pad. Uh, spoke to the commander about this. I, all these damned aliens aboard the Alliance's most advanced ship, I don't trust them. I sp 
that damn Asari. An Aquarian. What does Shepard think this is? A zoo? Who's that? Oh, it's Nav Navigator Presley. What a knob. With the Aquarian, it seems she's on some kind of pilgrimage, trying to improve the, the lot of her home ship. I can understand that. I would babysit my children or anything, or anything, but if she has to be on board, I suppose that's not too bad. For a while now, and I'm taking a look back at past entries on in this journal. I, how blind I was at the time. I came on this ship firmly believing humanity was on its own in the galaxy. Shepard brought all these aliens on board, and there's no way we could have com accomplished what we did without them. I'm proud to say, die for any member of this crew, regardless of what world they were born on. We converted him. We converted Navigator Presley. Is this where it says Normandy? Down here? Hmm. Hmm. I don't know whether there's a better place for it. It does say Normandy there, though. But hmm, I don't think I want it here. <laughs> Let's see if there's a better place that says Normandy. Ooh, my N7 helmet. Oops. <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. Is that wearable or is that a collectible? Like, is that just something that we put in our office? I can't remember. Because I'm technically wearing an N7 helmet already. So I don't know. I don't know whether that just goes in my office as a mem memorabilia of when I died. <laughs> it's so eerily quiet here. Oh, that's probably where it says Normandy nicely. Yeah, that's probably it. That's probably where we want to put it. No, I don't want to place the monument here. The sleeping tube things. Seven to go. this? What is this area? I'm not sure what this is. Oh, it's where Ashley was. Is it? That's not what it looks like. Is it really? Mm. Oh no, it's the, uh, it's the table thing. The Ashley thing. The Ashley memory was from when we first got Ashley, wasn't it? It's the mess hall. That's what it was. I'm not placing it there, though. Three more to go. Two to go. Yeah, that's where I'll put it over where it says normally over there. Okay, just one to find. Now, where could it be? Wait, we haven't in, in like we haven't initiated the uh, memory from the. Uh, Miko. Why isn't Gareth stood next to it? Okay. Where could this last dog tag be? It's probably over by the Normandy, actually. Where I want to place the monument. If it's not, I'm going to have to go searching for it, because I don't know where else it's going to be. Yep, there it is. Cool. Yep, that's definitely where I'm placing the monument. How was I carrying this? <laughs> Sorry, there's a...
fly. Okay. Cool, I don't think there's anything else to do here. I think that is it. I guess you have to have your gun out to be able to do that. Weird. Okay, let's go back to the Normandy. The new Normandy. Did my game just cra crash? My game just crashed. Great. Great, great, great. I hope that saved. Sorry, this is loud. I do apologize. Hopefully I don't have to do all that again. So I haven't, I haven't placed the thing yet, but have I got all of the, uh, how many have I got? Oh man, when did it save? Place a monument, have I got, I'm assuming I've got all the tags. Uh, how am I gonna tell? It didn't tell me how many I've got. The tag's not over here, which suggests that we have got all all 20, so we can leave again. I'm going to save just before going onto the ship this time, just so we know, we know exactly what we, where we've got to. And hopefully it doesn't crash this time. Okay, good. That's <laughs> didn't crash this time. We're all good. Why am I all the way over here? Get back over there. Got to do some more. Pro I just went through a sun. Got to do some more probing. Today's stream is good. The next few streams probably actually are going to be quite a lot of probing to be honest. I do, I just enjoy it so much so uh, I am going to be doing it. I don't know why I enjoy this so much. It's very repetitive but I like it. You get some side missions from it as well like when you find anomalies and stuff so it's not all bad. Do get some ground missions as well. It won't be just probing. Probe away. And I need to do it anyway because we need to be able to upgrade everything. Because if we don't upgrade everything we lose people. And I'm not losing people. We're, we're doing this without losing anyone. Probe launched. I always... I, I, I don't think I've ever done a playthrough where I haven't saved everyone. Because I just do everything to the complete. I don't like leaving things un like not done in games, so I find it very hard to like not upgrade fully, get all the team, do all their side missions and stuff. So I don't lose anyone because of that. Which is definitely a good thing. Okay, we'll go back and buy more probes after this as well. I might actually have a look in a sec, actually, because I have, I do have a guide for Mass Effect 2 um, sitting just next to me, actually. Um, which will tell me the Normandy upgrades, so it'll tell me if there is a 60 probe, 
upgrade because I might aim to try and do it if I can. Well, we went from moderate to depleted, like I said, you sometimes do. Let me just have a look at this quickly. Let's see. Um. Normally upgrades. Page 39. Normally upgrades. Modular probe bay. Yes, here we go. Normally now has 100% extra probe capacity. 30 survey probes added to the ship's complement. Um, how do I get that though? It doesn't tell me how I get it. How do I? It doesn't tell me who. What it should do. It's tell me who tells me about it. Because it says all ship up upgrades must be researched. To obtain these research projects, talk to your crew members and ask them about research. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four five, six, seven. Is it one per actual person? Hmm. Let me let me Google it instead. That might be easier because it will probably tell me who who uh, gives it me. So it is the modular probe prober? No, probe bay. Upgrade guide. This is what I want. There we go, okay. Uh, Thane. Need to grab Thane. Maybe once we finish the system, we'll go to the Citadel then and grab Thane. Because I do want that. Not this system, but this uh, cluster, I should say. So when I finish all of these areas. So we got. Just finish the one I'm on now, that one and that one. Then we'll go to the Citadel and do the missions there. And go, that actually gets us a few more people as well. The Citadel's got a few extra uh, teammates, squad members. In this system. Launching probe. Probe launched. Okay, we're on poor already. I'm really trying, struggling to find any like big chunks of any of the uh, elements right now. We've got 60,000 60, palladium. That's quite a lot. Launching probe. There's a big chunk of something. Platinum, mostly, but a bit of everything. Probe 
away. Probe launched. There's some iridium, uh, iridium, iridium, oh my god, why can't I, I can sometimes say words, sometimes I can't, iridium, yeah, I was going to say, there's some iridium nearby, there it is, okay. Come on, give us this junk. Okay, it's only a small bit. Launched. And there it is, depleted. Um, this is actually the end of this system, so we will go... Commander, you've received a new yes, message yes, yes. at your private terminal. I know. You told me already. I've probably got more, though. Okay. Can we do anything? I don't know whether we've actually got any... The right stuff at the moment. No, we don't. What do we actually need for all this? Platinum. Huh? Oh, I already. Oh, okay. I was gonna say I have enough. I just need some other stuff, other requirements first, to be able to do these anyway. That makes more sense. Medi gel capacity need more of. Okay, fair enough. That makes more sense. What about these? Yeah, same with these as well. Okay, interesting. Okay, so I can't actually do upgrades at the moment, <laughs> but I'm, I'm still gonna collect like uh, resources. For you, That's not true. You just told me I have new messages. Now you're telling me there's none. Make up your mind. Um, I'm still gonna do collecting of resources and stuff because that means as soon as I can do the research, like as soon as it's available to like do it, I can actually do it straight away because I've got the resources already there. It's not a bad thing having extra resources straight away. Can I just like click, like, enter? How do I, how do I, can I not do a, a way of doing probes easily as well? Apparently not. Okay, we'll go over to this system next. Three planets here. So a rich planet, rich in iridium, apparently. It's a very uh, uh, bumpy planet where it looks things. It looks like it's been hit by a lot of meteorites, this planet. So there's a lot of craters. Oh, hello. <laughs> Accidentally let go and then clicked on it again and it was, here yeah, look, have a lot of iridium. And even more down here as well. Over 50,000 iridium now. Which is good. Launched. Platinum's got to do some catching up again now. Especially on the palladium. Spike, spike. Um, 
launching probe. Launching probe. Order it to deplete it again. Okay, we're gonna go um, pop back to the uh, fuel station again because we got less than 15. The fuel depot, sorry. Why can't I buy probes? Come on, thank you. So clunky. See if we can use less than 15 probes for both of these two, get this system done as well. It's a rich plant again though, so probably won't. Rich plants always use more because obviously they've got more stuff on them. Actually, that's not necessarily always the case because they can have high concentrations in like small areas. So more big spikes. Oh, I just realized we're over 70,000 in the Palladium. Which one's going to be first to 100,000? Probably Palladium, just because I'm not spending it at all at the moment. So it's not like any of them are going to drop at the moment. Yeah, it's a little bit. Oh, hello. Big jump on both of those two. Nice. Down to moderate now. Launching probe. Iridium is actually catching up uh, Palladium now. Gets to over 40,000 on Platinum. Nice. Oh. Launched. Depleted. Oh, it's so close to catching up now. Okay. Um, wait, how many did I use? <laughs> oh, man. Okay, fine. We'll go back. I'm so glad that I brought so much money in from uh, Mass Effect 1, because this is expensive. This is just one cluster. I haven't even started to go into other places yet, I haven't used a Mass Relay yet. Another rich planet as well. Launching probe. Oh, that's almost even now. Palladium and iridium. Oh, this will see iridium go above actually. Probe launched. Probe launched. 
could be Iridium that gets to 100,000 first. At this rate, we're getting lots of Iridium around here. Which we are. I'm hoping there's not an upper limit on these. On the amount that you can hold of these resources. It's still rich after, like, sending out six probes as well. There's a lot of resources on this planet, apparently. I like it. We could potentially get to 100,000. I don't know to click that button. At least we got a little bit of platinum from that. Um, we could potentially get to 100,000 on uh, Iridium on this planet, potentially, if we get some more big spikes. Maybe. It's dropped down to good now, though. Away. We can certainly get very close to uh, 100,000. Depends how much more of this good is actually Iridium. If it's all Iridium, then yeah, then we probably would get all the way up there. But it probably isn't all Iridium. Launched. Very unlikely to be. It is a very iridium high planet though, by the looks of things. We are mostly getting iridium. There's iridium in most probe launchers. Launching probe. Launching probe. Bit of everything. Deplete it. Okay, and that's this system done oh wait no i already know i can't do any of the upgrades so there's no point even checking actually is there we already know that we can't we need to get we need to find other stuff first okay last system we're 95% done in the Omega Nebula. Nebula. Oh, is it just one planet in this area? Fair enough. Okay. Cool. And visit 100% of the planets in an unexplored cluster. Nice. And straight into some Iridium. It's another rich planet. So many rich planets right now. getting any high readings at the moment. This is a very Earth looking like planet. Whoa, never mind. High readings. But yeah, this looks a lot like Earth, this planet. It's got Earth Earth vibes. That's quite a chunk of each, to be honest. Oh, platinum is so close to being 50,000 again. There you go. It's finally got back above the 50,000 mark where it was before I bought what, what did, I can't remember what I bought for 50,000 platinum. One of the uh, Normandy upgrades. Launching probe. There is some probe platinum away. down here as well. There it is. <laughs> probe away. Told you. Okay, Platinum's got to its highest point because it was at 54,000 when we spent 50,000 on it, of it. So it's made made it back up to where it was before. Probe away. Probe away.
launching probe. Or oh, iridium's nearly above ninety thousand. This should get it above ninety thousand. There it is, ninety thousand. So close to that hundred thousand mark. I am worried that hundred thousand will be the limit. To be fair, it might be nine nine hundred ninety nine thousand is the limit. I'm just like looking at the box size and thinking what size number can actually fit into that box. I reckon nine hundred ninety nine thousand is probably the most. I don't think you can get a million. Launching probe. We'll find out though, I'm sure. Okay, we're done here. 100%. Cool. Okay, so um, I did, like I say, want to go find Thane, who is on the Citadel, if I remember correctly. Let me just fuel up and stuff though. Plot mass relay jump. So in the uh, in game number one, we were like, "Whoa, what have I just done?" Uh, we were like in this area of the Milky Way, and now in um, in this one, we're on this side of the Milky Way. Um, how do you get pain? Let me uh, let me come out of there. Is they not? Oh, in fact, you know what we should do? We should do our uh, look through our messages, actually. Um, seeming as we did get some there. Uh, Commander, we got the data you sent. If this went public, it could do some serious damage to Cerberus's image. This intel will take years to decode, but just having it is a huge win for the Alliance. Well done, Shepard. Good luck on your mission. Anderson. Awesome. Um, Omega Clinic desk. Here we go. Commander, I wanted to thank you again for saving me from those Batarians. I thought I'd seen the worst of people's anger and fear at Dr. Solosis's clinic. I had no idea how much anger his work was keeping in check. How bad it really was. If not for you, I'd be dead. Thank you. The clinic is doing well. You got rid of most of the plague, and I've been able to handle the rest without too much trouble. The Blue Suns keep offering to take over security here. I keep the mechs powered on. I won't make the same mistake twice. Thanks, Daniel. Commander Shepard. The Alliance was grateful to receive the information you found at the Anomaly's crash site, and we've sent it out to the affected families. By finding those dog tags, you have pr provided peace of mind for a lot of people. Commander, I thank you on their behalf. Cool. Okay. Um, the real reason I came back out here is to use my... Come on. Um, was to use my journal, because I wanted... Who's Master Thief? That's Kasumi Goto. Wait, how do I get... How do I get Thane, then? I'm so confused. How do you get Thane? Uh, what mission gives you Thane? I don't know how to get Thane. Like, he's not in any of our dossier. I'm sure he's on the Citadel, though. I am sure of it. So we will go to the Citadel. Um, now, because I'm... I'm I'm almost 100% certain he's on the Citadel. Okay. My sensitivity out here is very... Why is this already 100%? I haven't been here yet. You can't leave this one. 
Okay, Citadel. There's a, quite a lot to the Citadel, to be honest, so we'll be here for a little while. And we go to different areas of the Citadel now, to uh, before. Not in the Presidium. We're down in the wards this time. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favourite shop on the Citadel. We're going to be saying that a lot. That is where this comes from. Um, who do I bring? I'm going to bring. I'm going to bring the same two that we just had. To be honest. Uh, we haven't got any new weapons, so we won't bother doing any of that. Commander Shepard, enter the password and receive a free gift. It's Kasumi. I will in a sec. Let me just do a little bit of exploring. Galactic news. We already listened to that. That was on Omega. Got problems with collectors? Try Kasumi's credit services. <laughs> Keepers. Fascinating creatures. Genetic constructs adapted to work in Citadel. Couldn't survive outside. Unknown purpose. Wish I could have studied them. Had other things to do instead. We studied them. Okay, let's get Kasumi. Hi, Kasumi. Please tell me your password, Commander Shepard. Cut the <laughs> Silence is golden. Silence is golden. Good to finally meet you, Commander Shepard. Kasumi Goto. I'm a fan. Have you been briefed? In on the mission? Honestly, I'm shocked they didn't come to see me sooner. My fault for being hard to find, I guess. True. Why the secrecy? What's with the password and the sneaking around? Are you in trouble or something? I'm the best thief in the business, not the most famous. Need to watch my step to keep it that way. You don't want to be a famous thief. Sure the whole point legit. is that you're not caught. And I have no doubts now. You're the real Commander Shepard. You sure? What makes you so sure? There's a certain aura about you. Like you've seen things no one else has. Well, that's Even without certainly what true. You, like, I knew it was you. you and Cerberus. brought you to Cerberus. That's a bit of a story. Short version, they were looking for me. So I trailed them to find out why. <laughs> Turns out they were looking for someone to join you on an important mission. And we're offering a serious signing bonus. I had a thing I needed help with, so I made them a deal. And here we are. What deal? I assume this deal is something I should know about. Yeah, I guess it slipped their minds. It always does. I'm looking for my old partner's grey box. A man named Donovan Hawk took it. It's funny that she's just and above me. To get it back. What's this heist you're planning? Not here, Shepard. You'll get a briefing when the time comes. I need time to nail down the details. Because she's a um, the liberty of getting you some evening wear, though. DLC character. It's like Saeed. It just you get given the the um, loyalty mission. What do you know about Donovan Hawk? Mr. Hawk is a well-respected businessman, arms dealer, murderer. Generally not a great guy. His mansion's famous for being hard to crack, but I have a way in, and I think. Oh, I remember that mission actually. Expecting trouble? You know, Hawk's the kind of guy who takes kindly to people sneaking into his house. I think it's an art show or something. Party that we go in. Uh, go into, I think. I assume a gray box is some kind of hardware. It's a neural implant, illegal in most places. Stores Ooh. memories, cool thoughts, eyes. secret codes, illicit information. This one in particular belonged to my partner, Keiji Okuda. We worked together for a long time. Before Hawk killed him. Oh my. Tell me about this former partner of yours. His name was Keiji Okuda. We know that. The best hacker and entry man I've ever known. Unfortunately, he slipped up and made himself infamous. Oops. He stole something he shouldn't. He warned me it was bad. Something that could spark interstellar war if it got out. Yikes. That information. <laughs> Look there she is. Got him killed. What could he have found that's so bad? He wouldn't say what it was, just that it was dangerous. He said if it got out, humanity would be in trouble. Humanity would he be in trouble? It, wrapped it up in his own memories. To decode the information, you have to sift through all the time we spent together. 
Now those memories are all that's left of him. I see why you want it. I can understand why you'd want to get it back. Getting it back will be easier with your help, Shepard. Okay, we'll take care of it. That's what Cerberus promised you. We'll get it done. It'll be fun. And if we're lucky, you won't even have to draw your gun. True. We should probably wrap this up. <laughs> you look pretty silly standing there talking to an advertisement. See you on the ship, Shepard. I'm going to go grab her because I like using... I'm, I'm going to try and use more characters through this playthrough. Because the difference with this one is I don't have to have each character with their own specific upgrades and armors and stuff like I do in Mass Effect 1, where it's easier just to keep track of one character, like two characters and use that team throughout the whole thing. Whereas this one I want to try and mix it up a little bit. So I'm going to bring Garrus and Kasumi. Do we have... Confirm. Kasumi, what weapons do you use? Use... Oh, I kind of was expecting you to use a sniper rifle, to be honest. Okay. Uh, she does have upgrades to do, though, because we haven't used her yet. Auto. Do I have any? No, okay. Cool. Look, Kasumi. This recruit is a 20 kilo Ferris slug. Feel the weight. Every five seconds, the main gun of an Empress class dreadnought accelerates one to 1.3% of light speed. Nice clean it uniform, I like it. With the force of a 38 kiloton bomb. That is three times the yield of the city buster dropped on Hiroshima back on Earth. That means Sir Isaac Newton is the deadliest son of a bitch <laughs> in space. Now, serviceman Burnside, what is Newton's first law? Sir, an object in motion stays in motion, sir. No credit for partial answers, maggot. Sir, unless acted on by an outside force, sir. Damn straight! <laughs> I dare to assume you ignorant jackasses know that space is empty. Once you fire this hunk of metal, it keeps going till it hits something. True. That can be a ship or the planet behind that ship. It might go off into deep space and hit somebody else in 10,000 years. If you pull the trigger on this, you are ruining someone's day, somewhere and sometime. That is why you check your damn targets. That is why you wait for the computer to give you a damn firing solution. That is why, serviceman Chung, we do not eyeball it. This is a weapon of mass destruction. You are not a cowboy shooting what? from the hip. Sir, yes, sir. Wow. This recruit is a 20 oh, kilo God. Ferris slug. Feel the weight. Every five seconds, the main... I thought it might be nice to come back here and see how it's changed. But it's just like it was. Same dirty streets, same unrepentant scavengers, same revolving door prisons. Being security here is a terrible You okay there, Kasumi? This is exactly why I left. <laughs> Kazumi, is everything okay? Okay, let's uh, talk to the customs. Can I help you, sir? Security seems heavy. It's been a couple of years since I passed through here. Security seems I haven't to passed through here. After the Geth attack, there was a review of security protocol. A few minor changes were made to reduce the risk of Geth infiltration. We apologize for the inconvenience. You'd think a Geth would stand out. Assumptions are dangerous. Be alert, be safe. Thanks for your time. Next. I'm dead. I swear to God, I didn't touch anything. <laughs> Cause you're down. funny. What? Do you seriously think? Sorry for the inconvenience, sir. Hi, Mr. Pie Man. Thank you for the raid. To think you're How are you doing? Dead. How are you doing today? Hi, King. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing? Uh, technically I was dead. I was listed as missing in action a couple of years ago. Would you mind checking in with my captain? He can reinstate you in our system. Will He's do. just past the scanners on your right. Avina. You'll have to make him scream a little. Wait, He's not going to tell you everything just because you ask. I, I know, sir. If you don't have the stomach or you're worried about being reported, I can take care of it. No, sir. I can handle it. How was your stream, Mr. Pyman? What were you uh, What were you doing today? Okay, let's talk to Mr. Captain yes, Bailey. I see the problem already, Commander Shepard. My console says you're dead. Uh, yeah. Um, that's clearly wrong. I'm I'm not dead. I'm here. Are you not worried I'm some imposter claiming to be me? We have the best screening equipment in the galaxy. Those scanners can sample DNA from skin flakes. Hell, if you have unregistered gene mods, they can even figure those out. 
Hey, can you fix the it? The sergeant said you could help with that. Usually, you'd have to go through the station security administration to reactivate your IDs, then to customs and immigration oh my God. to regain that sounds like access a to the whole lot of hassle. Itself, and probably a stop by the treasury. Spending a year dead is a popular tax dodge. True. But I can see you're a busy man. Very. So how about I just press this button right here, and we call it done. Is that legal? Couldn't one of us or both of us get into trouble for that? There's no way to fool the DNA scanners in that tunnel. You're you. Why wait in long lines and fill out a mass of useless hard copy paperwork to get to the same place? True. The council does everything by the book. They've had thousands of years to write it. Sometimes things need to get done without a committee vote. Uh, seems a bit irregular. You're not big on formalities, are you? I'm with them right up until they keep people from doing their jobs. There. I just saved you about nine days of running around. That that's, said, you that's should useful. head up to the Presidium and tell them you're still alive. The Council probably wants to talk to the one who saved their scaly asses. How do I get there from here? What's the easiest way to get to the Presidium from down here? Head back through the security checkpoint and take a public shuttle. Oh, okay. Screw the council. Having no, access to I'm the council and the Spectre's resources would be useful. True, actually. I might yeah. do that right now. The council can get anything. Best thing about working CSEC is that any equipment, information, or money you need, you get. Anyway, something else you need? Or can I get back to work? Uh, we got a lot of stuff to talk to him about, apparently. I overheard your conversation. Make him scream a little. This isn't the Presidium. All they have to he worry likes slamming about his protesters desk. outside their free speech zones or someone's poodle crabbing on the grass. Down here, we have drugs, organized crime, and murder. Policing a ward is like policing New York City. Sometimes you have to work outside the council's rulebook. CSEC has changed. I've dropped a lot of frames, apparently. I don't know when that was. I do apologize. Hopefully you didn't miss anything important. It looks like most of the damage from Sovereign's attack has been repaired. The Presidium was pretty shot up. Of course, they fixed that first. Oh, yeah. All the wards got hit with debris when the ship exploded. Most of the damage was superficial, and the Keepers got things restored fast. Tasery Ward got the worst. A big chunk hit near the Dillanaga Concert Hall. They're still clearing wreckage and trying to get power restored. Um, I don't need to say get to council because we already know how to do that. Tell me about this place. All the wards are more or less multicultural, but the other four are dominated by Asari, Turians, or Solarians. So this one's got a lot of In humans. In Zikira, we've got major enclaves of Volus, oh, no. Elcor, and Hanar. There's also a human commercial zone at Shinakiba. We've got a few Krogan walking around, and I think I saw a quarry in the other day. Whoa. Uh, humans. Last time I was here, there were no human captains in CSEC. No, CSEC took a lot of casualties when the Geth boarded the Presidium. The Special Response Division was hard hit. They stopped turning their noses up at human resumes. They needed bodies in uniform, and we had the most experienced bodies. And we saved them. Okay, I should goodbye. Go. You need anything else? Let me know. Okay, we're going to go back to the uh, council. We'll do that now because that could be good to do. Make sure that they know I'm alive. Reinstate me as a spectre. All that jazz. Oh my god, I've got a lot of areas we can go to. Okay, Presidium. I think we can talk to Captain Anderson here. Yeah, there he is. And the council. This meeting would be more productive if Udina was to join us. No. My advisor is unavailable. As counselor, I represent the voice of humanity and the alliance. Yes, Councillor Anderson. Wait, he he's still count captain. Oh, Commander. We were just talking about you. It's been a long time, Anderson. I hope the last couple of years have treated you right. There have been some rough spots. It's good to have you back. We've heard many rumors surrounding your unexpected return. Some of them are unsettling. We called this meeting so you could explain your actions, Shepard. We owe you that much. After all, you saved our lives in the battle against Saren and his Geth. I certainly did. The Collectors are abducting human colonists in the Terminus systems. Worse, we think they're working for the Reapers. The Terminus systems are beyond our jurisdiction. Your colonists knew this when they left Council Space. You're missing the important part, Counselor. The Reapers are involved. 
Ah yes, Reapers. You can't Reapers. Starships, allegedly waiting in dark space. We Oh my god, you're researching on Shepard. No one else encountered the hologram on Ilos that told you the truth about the Reapers. Only you and your crew ever spoke with Sovereign. I believe you. You got but without pieces of him from another source. The others think Saren was behind the Geth attacks. Why would Geth follow Saren? Examine Virgil and or, or Sovereign. I don't know, think I don't think Vigil is uh, available anymore. Uh, uh, let's do Saren this. was an organic. The Geth would never accept him as their leader. They only followed him because he was Sovereign's agent. Saren was a compelling and charismatic individual. They're not people. He convinced the Geth the Reapers were real, just as he convinced you. No, it was part not of true. His plan to attack the Citadel. The Reapers uh, are just a myth, <laughs> one you insist on perpetuating. You, we we believe that you believe it, but that doesn't make it true. Uh. Go back to Ilos and talk to Vigil, or just look at what's left of Sovereign. It's obvious the technology is more advanced than ours. The hologram on Ilos is no yeah. longer functional, and we have found nothing to suggest that Sovereign was not a Geth creation. The Geth are capable of remarkable technological achievements. This is probably why Saren recruited them. This Reaper theory proves just how fragile your mental state is. Hey! You have been manipulated by Cerberus, and before them, by Saren. This is not... <laughs> I kept Saren from conquering the Citadel. I sacrificed human lives to save this council. We are in a difficult position, Shepard. You are working for Cerberus, an avowed enemy of the council. This is treason, a capital offense. That's too far. Shepard is a hero. I'm on this council too, and I won't let this whitewash continue. Maybe there is a compromise, not a public acknowledgement given your ties, but something to show peripheral support. Shepard, if you keep a low profile and restrict your operations to the Terminus systems, the council is willing to offer you reinstatement as okay. a spectre. I'll take that. Why is that a question? You died. Of course you were taken off the spectres. You weren't alive anymore. <laughs> Whatever. What does that mean? Will I need to start filing reports? That won't be necessary. This is a show of good faith on our part. We cannot become involved in an investigation regarding the missing colonies in the Terminus systems. But Spectre reinstatement shows our support of you personally. True. I'm on it. I accept your offer. It's good to have the Council on my side. Good luck with your investigation, Shepard. We hope for a quick resolution and a quick end to your relationship with Cerberus. Same. I don't want to be working for them either, to be honest. Well, but whatever. That went better than expected. You realize the council's offer is just symbolic. They won't actually do anything. I know. No need to burn bridges. Even if they don't help, I might as well stay on good terms. True enough. Don't worry about the council or the alliance. I'll find some way to keep them off your back. Shouldn't be too hard. As I've already been speaking to Admiral Hacker anyway. Oh, Udina says. Why is he still ambassador? He's advisor Udina Shepherd. now. They didn't bother updating their titles. I'm visiting my friend. How Anderson is doing. You don't have to cover for me. I invited Shepard here to speak with the Council. We just finished our meeting. You what? Consular, do the words political shitstorm mean anything to you? The Council reinstated my Spectre status. They're just happy I'm staying out in the Terminus systems. Yes, I could see how that arrangement works best for both sides. But you really Can we just should get rid of this guy? I don't like, like you, Dina. Without consulting with me first, Counselor. I don't answer to you, Dina. Why don't you go to your office and think about that for a while? <laughs> of course, Counselor. Good day to both of you. Oh, man. I really Sorry. don't like that guy. Udin has never gotten over the fact that I got the council position instead of him. Sometimes I need to put him in his place. <laughs> it didn't bother me. Udin is just doing his job. No, wait, what? no, I don't like the guy. He's got his uses. And if you want something done on the Citadel, he knows who can make it happen. Plus, he's always happy to attend all those formal diplomatic functions I can't be bothered with. <laughs> How long did it take to get this place? What are Garrison Kasumi doing over that? Still counting. The main areas of commerce and the most populated wards are complete. But estimates for total restoration are sitting around five years. 
The keepers always surprise us, though. It's like our repairs are annoying. We'll put up an ugly new bulkhead, and in a few days, they've made it seamless. We never really thought of them as heavy lifters, and I have no idea where they get the resources. But we'd never get done without them. Cool. Um. I'm surprised no one can tell Sovereign isn't Geth technology. Didn't they examine the wreckage? We don't have much to look at. Pieces have been rained all over the station. It was chaos, with who knows how many species combing the wards for their dead. We secured as much of it as we could. But between the keepers and a whole lot of unauthorized salvage, there's no way to account for even half of that thing. Another reason why they don't want to acknowledge what Sovereign was. Hmm. Last I knew, we were still fighting holdouts. Well, here and there. But they are increasingly disorganized. It's long since stopped being called a war. More like cleanup. That's good. Not that you can ever discount them. But we haven't had serious casualties for months. A civilian ship will spot an enclave and we send in a squad to clear it. Hmm. They're not quite the boogeyman they used to be. Good. Kim? What happened to Staff Lieutenant Olenko after the Normandy was destroyed? Staff Commander Olenko is still with the Alliance. But he's working on a special mission. It's classified. I oh, can't man. say any more. Not while you're working with Cerberus, I'm sorry. That's okay, I understand. How have the last couple of years treated you? Serving on the council isn't how I plan to spend my twilight years. Sorry, I just didn't want to put Udina in there. Sometimes it feels like I'm just beating my head against a wall. Knowing the truth about Sovereign is brutal. It's nightmare stuff. I can't blame others for not wanting to believe it. But I know how important it is. So I keep trying. Fighting the good fight, right? Come with me! <laughs> He's not Forget Udina and the council. Join my crew and help me stop the collectors. I'm too old to go racing across the galaxy. Much as I complain, I've got an important job to do here. The front line, that's got to be yours. See, better go. Of course, Shepard, I understand. I wish I could do more to help you. But if you ever want to talk, I'll be here. Just do me a favor and be careful. You can't trust Cerberus. I know. Hey, Asari, will you listen to the whole thing? How did you even get there? Oh, I guess you can go around the corner there. <laughs> Funny. Okay. Um, this is actually the only part of the Presidium you can actually go to now. I do like that it's still laid out exactly the same, though. Got the uh, consort office over there. Got the monument over there. And Avena is normally down there, but I can't see it for some reason. There's a lot of volus around here, aren't there? I guess the MC is just here as well, to be fair. Okay. Let's, uh... Ooh. Oh, no, it's Galactic News again. Let's go to level 26. Wait, what? This isn't where I want to be. This is... Okay, nope, never mind. This is not right. 27 dock. I want to make sure I don't miss anything by just skipping around. Okay. We can head in properly now. Access denied. But I'm a spectre. Yes. How'd you end up working on the Citadel? I never asked them this before. I started with the Alliance way back when, but the traveling was killing me. It's a shitty life if you're trying to raise a family and seeing your kids every six months. True. I joined C-Sec so I could stay in one place and put down roots. How'd you like you it? like life here on the Citadel? Yeah, life here is good. Hell of a lot different than life back on Earth. I miss the food mostly. You just can't get sockeye salmon here on the station. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Earth, every couple of years, less and less all the time. But when I finish my stint with C-Sec, there's a nice little place in the foothills I'm going to retire to. Aww. Not that I'm retiring anytime soon. I Fair should enough. be going. If you need anything else, let me know. Let's talk to Avina. Hi. Welcome back, Shepard. It has been two years, three months, and 17 <laughs> days since the Citadel last welcomed you. This is the Zakara Ward Transportation Hub. Public shuttles and shopping are she got a different voice. through the C-Sec security cordon. There seem to be a lot more CSEC officers than the last time I was here. In the wake of the Geth attack two years ago, additional security precautions were implemented for the safety and security of residents. Makes sense. In addition to increased CSEC patrols, weapon carry restrictions have been tightened. 
Why am I still wear wearing my weapons then? So has crime decreased? No. Violent crime has decreased oh, by good. 23%. Property crime has decreased by 41%. Incident clearance has improved by 16%. All good numbers? I need to talk to the council. How can I reach the Presidium from here? Why did I ask that? Public transit shuttles are available on the far side of the C6 security cordon. I didn't need to say that because... It looks like this place has recovered from Sovereign's attack. Repair of the damage from the Geth attack is ongoing. There is still extensive damage on Tasery Ward. What about the Reaper? Yeah, it was Sovereign who led the attack. A Reaper. I have no information on a Reaper. References to the term exist in some parahistorical theories on galactic extinction cycles. They're really selling the Geth did it message. Mm -hmm. I bet you can't even say Reapers without inciting a panic. Reapers! <laughs> What stores are available on this level? Only one store exists on this level. Citadel Souvenirs nice. offers licensed we'll, mementos of We'll your head there. We've got money to spend. Starship models is well regarded. I will go buy them then. Thank you for using Avena. Have a pleasant day. Will do. Welcome to Citadel Newsday. <gasps> Emily Wong. Officials in the Systems Alliance remain tight-lipped about the recent disaster. Wonder if we'll see her at all. Um, okay. Good day, my friends. Welcome to the Citadel. I'd like to buy something. My apologies. I do not make sales. I'm here to answer questions and process returns and exchanges. To make a purchase, browse our electronic catalog over there. Okay. Citadel These stores Souvenirs. Are owned by the Citadel, right? That's correct. Citadel Souvenirs outlets are owned by the council government. The profits generated by sales are used to maintain the station. We offer an assortment of decorations suitable for display in your personal quarters. Hmm. Endorsement? Since these stores are owned by the council, do government employees get a discount? Yes, in fact. Uh, what's your position? Spectre. I'm a spectre. That is quite a prestigious role. It is my pleasure to extend the government employee discount to you, spectre. Please, feel free to check the updated prices. <laughs> that wasn't an endorsement. That was just a discount. Space Am- Oh, I thought we found him in the ship. Oh, no, do you find him in- Ah... Do you find him number three because you get attacked again? I don't know. I mean, let's get this space hamster. Yes, give me the space hamster. And the fish. Ooh, they have a Normandy. The SS, um, the SR1 version of the Normandy. We also have the Destiny Ascension as well. Let's grab that. Cool. So do you want to get one of the fish or maybe a model ship? How is a model ship supposed to remind me of the Citadel? It's festive, and you like ships. You could get a model of the Citadel. I look at ships all day. <laughs> get a fish, then. Do I have a map of this place? Oh, my. That is confusing. There's a cafe? Oh, over that side there's a cafe. Okay. Let's do a quick... Lakes up on the Presidium are filled with fish. No, they're not. <laughs> you ever been up there? No. CSEC won't let me. They say I'm a risk. Oh, uh, man. They think every Krogan is dangerous. Damn Turians. You should kill them all. <laughs> and that's why you're not allowed in the Presidium. Hey, how do you know my name? You're an advertising board. But do you have the career skills to deploy and manage today's high-tech network infrastructures? I hear this is the best place for food on Zakara Ward. Ooh. You heard wrong. Food. This is the best place for food on the whole damn Citadel. Can I get a discount? This is my favorite store on the Citadel. Oh, okay. I guess not. High-grade provisions. Ascension novel. Okay. I don't know what these novels do. Like, I don't know where they went. Like, I bought one earlier. What do, where do they go? What do I do with those? But yes, we got some ingredients now. Which is good. Okay, so we can go to level 28. Yeah, we'll do that. And then we'll go to the other side later. Delivery to the... Your cabin is pending. Okay. I guess there's a pile of books, maybe, in my cabin? I don't know. Wait, 
Who was I? Ah, here we go. Use ship salesman. Greetings, Earth Clan. You will find many excellent ships for sale here. I have an excellent ship. Only slightly used, yes. No. With our unification day special, you can get up to two thousand credits back. Such a deal. Sure. Could I interest you in a Turian Esperin sporting shuttle? Unmatched acceleration, peerless maneuvering, and like all Turian shuttles, it can fit a light mass accelerator cannon. Perfect for heavy traffic. Sure. I offer a no money down lease on my quality used ships. Ah, I know. Okay. <laughs> one of our light haulers. I have several Kowloon modular conveyors. Available. We'll uh, we'll start talking. Chef. You ever had ramen? It's a delicacy back on Earth. You know what I haven't had in ages? Ramen. Is she My Asian? My used to make the best ramen. She is. Delicious. Thinking back, I really should have stolen her recipe. <laughs> what can I get you? Nothing. Uh, let's talk to Avina, find out what's here. Welcome. The Zakara Ward Marketplace provides shopping and storage space for the less privileged residents of the station. What sort of things are sold here? The Surter Foundation, a medical technology group from the Alliance, has an outlet store. Sarinus Applications offers professional software. Why are there warehouses in the middle of a shopping district? <laughs> this area is close to Zakara Ward's keel docking station. Freighters attach there to load passengers and supplies. Goods are stored locally until they can be distributed within the ward or transported off the station. However, Ew, you can see a whole eye. that visitors exercise caution, as these short-term warehouses are often used to move illegal goods. That's not good. This area looks a little run down. I take it the people here aren't very well off? Inhabitants of the wards typically have less income than those in the Presidium. How would you fix it? There must be some way to solve the problem. Asari futurists believe poverty cannot be eliminated without cornucopia technology, which will create anything the user desires. Such technology is unknown outside of science fiction literature. Hmm. Something like that could put me out of business. Yep. <laughs> and here I thought the Citadel was some sort of utopia. The recorded histories of all sapient species suggest that in every society, resources are not evenly split between members. Fair enough. That's all for now. Thank you for using Avina. Mm, it's unfortunate. Have a pleasant day. Let's go into this store. Can I say this is my favorite store on the Citadel now? Welcome to Sarinus Applications. Can I interest you? Ah, Shepard. Do we know you? I know you. Oh. No, but I know <laughs> you. Even a senile Hanar would remember the human who fought off the Geth. I thought you were dead. Yeah, I was. I've been getting that a lot. <laughs> Please look around the store. It's a pleasure to have you here. I'd like to buy something. Oh, it's all automated these days. There's a catalog interface over there. What's your job? If everything's automated, why are you here? Customer service. That's a horrible noise. Sweeping out the store, carefully explaining things to the technologically illiterate. <laughs> it's stunning yeah. how many people think that light moves faster through expensive fiber optic cables than it does through cheap ones. Okay. One and you know, I use quite a bit of software in my line of work. It's a shame so few understand their own equipment. Besides the most obvious point and go nav interfaces anyway. You wouldn't believe how often I hear, why is the ship turning around? We're only halfway there. <laughs> oh, I would. You know, I like your products. Any interest in an endorsement from the human who defeated Sarin? I'd be thrilled. But I don't think I could afford to pay you for it. Don't worry about it. What if we just work out a discount? Isn't that the same as paying me? Just speaking to my console here. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. There it is. <laughs> that will be splendid. That's going to be said that in every store on the Citadel. Thank you so much. <laughs> okay. Uh, tech damage, we'll buy that. This should come in handy. Shield upgrade, we'll buy that. And, ooh. Reach, I, I'm, I'm going to buy it just for completion's sake, but my thing I've got right now is better anyway. Okay, what else we got around here? Another keeper. Maybe the immuno booster? It's Oops. supposed to help with alien bacteria. We can get whatever you'd like, Crooked Old Jake, Rebecca. 
Wait, the immuno booster can delay muscle development in high gravity and oh, mouth isn't moving. What if that hurts him? What is that noise? Good day, citizen. Welcome to the Serta Foundation Outlet on Zakir Award. I'd like to buy something. Purchases are made through our catalog interface. It's over there. What's your oh, Thanks for your time. Of course. I didn't mean to say goodbye. Good day, citizen. If everything's done by catalog, why are you here? Because she says the same thing. Returns, exchanges, and the group rates. We also find that sales are better when there's someone to personally interact with. Then why is there a machine? For why a human company exclusively hires a sari to work their stores. I know exactly why. <laughs> Tell me about your store. The Serta Foundation is a human organization known for its genetic therapy regimens and genetically engineered products. Serta is probably best known for the development of Metagel. Ah, huh, nice. Do endorsement? I couldn't help but notice your prices. They seem a bit steep. With respect, the Foundation is not concerned with profits. A portion of our sales funds research to cure genetic diseases. You know what would make your services more popular? An endorsement from the man who defeated Saren. Oh my! You are Shepard, aren't you? I would be glad to give you my employee discount if you would do that for us. Of course! What's the deal? <laughs> Just speak into my console here. I'm Commander Shepard. And this is my favorite what about the one over the way from here? That one's my favorite. Advertising I love how many times you can do this. Do it in every store. Every store is my favorite. Uh, mini gel capacity. Now what's this? A life support weapon. Interesting. Goodbye. Can I get it to say it? I'm Commander Shepard, there it is. And this the nerve enhancements say oh. there are occasional motor control side effects. Jake loves to run. What if it makes him fall down? Jake is fine, Rebecca. He's a perfectly healthy toddler. Wouldn't a refreshing, delicious to pop I just got no. a refund in exchange, and I was told to pick up a new Omni Jail converter here. I don't think you have the right place. No, they said to go to the warehouse. This is the warehouse. This is a warehouse. Okay. What's going on in here? Anything illegal? Anything for looty loots? Any talking? Nothing? Nope, there's no point being here right now. I think we'll come back here later though, if I remember correctly. Look, it took me a long time to get this refund. It's a decision on Joe. He said there'd be one waiting for me. Do you have a service order? No, I got the refund, made the exchange, and then he said go to the warehouse. I feel like you might have been stitched up there. Oh, I thought it was Tali then. I'm sorry. I'm trying to take a statement here. There's nothing to talk about. She stole my credit shit. Arrest her. I did not. Just because I'm a Quarian. I need you to stop and take a deep breath. You're mocking me, <laughs> Earth Clan. Just because the Vault Clan need. It was a poor choice of words, sir. I apologize. You Corn? say you're falsely accused? Walk into the used ship dealer when he barged into me outside the Serta Foundation. He didn't stop or say he was sorry. A minute later, he runs up with CSEC and accuses me of stealing his damn chip. Maybe the chip fell? into each other outside the Serta Foundation. Is it possible the chip fell out of his pocket there? I guess. Sure, all I know is I didn't take it. Do you spend a lot of time at the used chip dealer? Yeah, they've got a lot of nice models. I'd like to buy one and take it back to the fleet, but... That's a great idea. A ship would make a great pilgrimage gift. <laughs> She's so you shocked. you know about the pilgrimage? Of course. I traveled with a quarian who was on hers. I... Wow. I didn't know anyone here would do that for one of us. Why not? Uh, Volus. You say she stole your credit chip? She must have. When I left... Serta Foundation store. She ran right into me. She just ran into you? How does running into you mean she stole your credit chip? That's how pickpockets work. True. They bump into you and use that as a cover for rifling your pockets. You can't turn your back on these clanless quarians. Thieves. All of them. I don't think so. 
Uh, did you leave it at the store? Are you sure you didn't leave your chit at the Certa Foundation? Of course not. You think I'd make a mistake like that? Just checking. I didn't even buy anything there. That chit stayed in my mm. pocket. Mm. You know who's telling the truth? My Omni tool can tell the Quarian doesn't have a chit on her. But she could have stashed it to recover later. You know what Quarians are like. Hey! And she's definitely a vagrant. I'll run her in and see what Bailey wants to do with her. No. That is not how this works. Can find out what happened. Sir, this is a C sec. Matter. I'm a Spectre. We'll do all we can. All we can to resolve this. We don't I'm not a civilian, I'm a Spectre. If you do happen to find the chit, please let one of our officers know. Let's go. Be careful out there. Find the chit. Pretty sure he did leave it here. Good day, citizen. Welcome to the Serta Foundation Outlet. I remember the citizen. I endorse this place. A bolus was in here not too long ago. Did he drop a credit chit? And not that I saw. He didn't purchase anything. Hmm. Thanks for your time. Come back soon, Shepard. Oh, she does know who I am. Okay, so it wasn't there. But did he go to this store and buy something here? Commander Shepard. Oh. And this is my favorite store. And then, because he didn't buy anything in the other place, didn't realize it was missing when actually left there. Ah, my favorite customer. What can I get you? A bolus was in here not too long. How do we know that? Did he drop a credit chit? Oh, yes. He bought some environmental system drivers, then left without his chit. I didn't notice he'd left until he was already gone. If you see him, tell him I have it here behind the counter. Will do. Goodbye. Thanks for your time. I'll be here if you need anything. Yeah, yeah. We worked it out. It's all good. Don't you worry, CSEC officer. I know how to do your job better than you do, apparently. I felt her hand go into my you did not. When I checked it. Please move along. No. You forgot your credit chit at Saronis Applications. The clerk is holding it for you. Oh. Well. The Quarian could have stolen it. I'll close his Duh. She could have done, but she didn't. You. Get a permanent residence, or I'll run you in for vagrancy. Are you too serious? What? You falsely accused this girl of stealing from you. All you have to say now is that she could have stolen it. <laughs> yeah, push him around. Now, just a minute. And you, she gets harassed and insulted by this guy, and you throw in a threat to arrest her for vagrancy? How about if I run you in for obstruction uh, of justice? I'm a spectre. You cannot do that. Do you know who I am? You think you're going to run in a spectre? I think both of you should get out of here. Oh, son of a... <laughs> Thank you. I wish I could give you something more than words. Don't worry. You don't need you to. take care of yourself from here? I guess. I mean, most nights I eat nutrient paste in a Turian Ew. shelter. But I'm surviving. Can Thanks. I pay for her to get out of here? Can I buy a ship for you, please? I got a thousand credits for that. Thanks. Okay. Um, I think we're done in this area. Wait, can I talk to this guy and buy, him a, buy her a ship? No. You know what makes a ship no, I don't. Leave me alone. Well, we're, we're nowhere near where I thought we were. We're on one of the arms right now. Weird. Okay. Let's go to the other side now. I wonder what a Presidium fish would taste like. I'm telling you, there are no fish up there. <laughs> Garrus, how rude! Wait, where's Kasumi? Oh, she's there. not on the Presidium. That'd be the death. Erd not Rex was on the Presidium. He was with me. Okay. Let's keep going. Oh, this is where the bar is, I think. So what do you think? Maybe a shotgun? I like the assault rifle. It's like a non-stop barrage of death. If you can hit anything. Mm -hmm. Get out of my way. What can I do for you? I thought weapons were restricted on the Citadel now. Carrying them around is. Selling them isn't. We store them in off-site containers and deliver them to your ship. People Makes sense. Have your armor is like really cool. Can walk out with them. I like your armor. 
I'd like to buy something. Try our electronic catalog interface. That kiosk over there. Tell me about your services. We sell quality hunting supplies, which you'll need when you purchase one of our adventure travel packages. Ooh, let's do it. Imagine it, human. The break of day. You and your team have been stalking a Shatha for five oh, days. What? In that time, it's killed four men. Excuse me? This sounds very dangerous. Are you okay? You see it. Line it up. Take the shot. Blam! It's down. You're the hero. That's what we offer. Not a vacation, but an experience. Sounds interesting. What's your job? If everything's done by catalog, why are you here? Rodham believes in salesmanship. Everyone does, touch. apparently. Some say we're old-fashioned. We recognize that adventure traveling is a niche. A small, tight-knit community. Okay. Favorite store in the city, though? Your expeditions might be a little tame for me. <laughs> tame? A human can hardly take down a feral baron. Excuse me. Baron, I took out Shatha. Saren. You think you are? And the, uh... Well, my name's Shepard, and... The Shepard? The one that put down Saren Arterius? Oh, you do know me. By the spirits. Shepard, in my store. I don't suppose I could convince you to record an advertisement <laughs> for me. Sure of course. Could. Can we work out a discount? A discount? I'd name my first born. I don't get you anything if you for ask. That. Can we record it now? Just speak towards my console. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. As are uh, all of them. No other gun shop has that kind of endorsement. No, but a tech company do, and a medical company do. So, yeah, you're not the only one. Oh my god. There's a lot of stuff. Okay, well, let's buy it all. This is valuable. Ooh, hammer. Ooh, that visor looks very strange. New sniper rifle. I like that interface. And those goggles are weird. Okay. Let's keep going. Game salesman. Have you tried Galaxy of Fantasy yet? I love that game. It's based on Turian mythology, but it's really fun. I hear it has 11 billion players now. Wow. Do you have any games you'd like to trade in? You get two credits toward a new game. Two credits? No thanks. Sounds very realistic though. The people want oh, to hear I thought your story, em Shepard. I thought it was Emily Wong. It's not Emily Wong. Police have been seen in Algelani. Wait, you, we met her before, didn't we? I interviewed you two yes. years ago when you first became a specter. Yes, I know. I remember. Case very well on camera. Do you have a minute? You made me look bad. What? So you can try to do another smear job on me? Now, Shepard, you may object to my methods, but we're on the same side. Then don't make me look bad, like an idiot. Nice. I just want to give your story its due. You can actually punch her, it's kind of funny. I'm not going to do it though, because it's Renegade. Sources claim you were at the heart of the Presidium during the Battle of the Citadel. It's fair to say the course of the battle hinges Kasumi, get out of the way. Words. You don't want your face on that. You told Admiral Hackett to assist the Destiny Ascension, costing hundreds of human That's where you can punch her. And securing the continued dominance of the Citadel Council. We stood as one to save many. The Turians lost 20 cruisers. Figure each had a crew around 300. The Ascension, the Asari Dreadnought we saved, had a crew of nearly 10,000. But surely the human cost. The Alliance lost eight cruisers. Shenyang, Emden, Jakarta, Cairo, Seoul, Cape Town, Warsaw, Madrid. And yes, I remembered them all. Everyone in the Fifth Fleet is a hero. The Alliance owes them all medals. The Council owes them a lot more than that. And so do you. <laughs> Take that! Commander Shepard, first human specter. Hero of the Battle of the Citadel. Check bid. Do we get it? Great. Bull rushed on my own show. Yeah, that's right. Okay, have you know? Welcome. The Zakara Ward Promenade offers upscale shopping and entertainment options for the discerning visitor. Entertainment? What entertainment options are available? So wait, I the guess we can't. Can I not do Thane yet then? Because it's not an option here. Dancing. What stores are in this area? Rodham Expeditions sells high-grade weapons as well as yeah, I already bought travel all. packages to the galaxy's most dangerous destinations. That's all for now. 
Thank you for using Avena. Um, Have a pleasant day. Okay, let's uh, let's go in here. I think these doors go to the same place. Yeah, they do. Oh. Do for you? <laughs> fish I know on the, the groundskeepers for the Presidium. Do you know if there are fish in the lake? I get that question a lot. I think it's right behind where's the restroom. Those are reservoirs. The Presidium's own supply, independent from the water storage tanks in the pools. The only place I know of on the station to get a live fish is the Leosanese gift shop. That's what we drink. Can I pour a glass of water? It's the same stuff that tourists throw garbage in. Well, it's clean. Oh, they purify it. Yes. Yeah. If some solarian or human bacteria gets left in, and a Turian or Florian drinks it, they could die. Everything would be so much simpler if we all had the same DNA. But no, the universe <laughs> loves diversity. Thanks for your time. No problem. I can now tell the Krogans. I forgot you could do that. I thought I, I thought I remembered being able to talk to them. Hello? Did Kasumi follow? Kasumi, this is the men's toilet. What are you doing in here? No, Kasumi, get out. Dance. Wait, why was it dance question mark? I'm sure it said dance question mark. It does say dance question mark. <laughs> why? Why is it a question? Okay. Anything interesting going on around here? Serve drinks. If you want to know what's going on? Check the news. He, he's got pink head. Nice. I don't know why humans always ask me that. Because that's you get you get information from pubs and bars and stuff. I want the strongest thing you have. Easy enough. Hey, he's got the same like outfit as the guy in the in the store. I like it. I like it. This is it's green. So? It's guaranteed to knock you on your ass. Unless you're Dextro DNA like me. If you are, it'll kill you. Oh, oh okay. Well, it didn't kill me, so Anything I must else? not be like you. Another one. Let's have another one. There you are. At least this bartender's not trying to kill me. Neither the Batarian one on Anything Omega. Else? Another one. Not done yet. I'm impressed. I've never seen anyone drink three of these. Well, I'm going to take a fourth. Else? Another one. Hit me again. How about we mix it up? This is genuine Batarian ale, uncut. Don't ask how I got it. It's still green. I've been serving here eight years. I've never seen anyone have this and stay on their feet. Well, I'm still up apparently, so I can ask for another one. Anything else? Do it. <laughs> okay, for you, something special. This is Krogan liquor, Rincon. You'll set off radiological alarms after you drink it. Should I pour you a quad? I don't want to do renegade stuff. Yeah, we'll do it. Oh yeah, put more of the stuff in the thing where stuff goes in. Just cause. Your funeral, pal. Just cause. Why not? That looks so awkward. It's not properly in his hands, but okay. I think this one does knock you out. Bye bye. To the toilets we go. Oh, my visor thing. That was weird. Oh, there's a Turian taking a piss. Lovely. Kasumi, stop watching him. Are they technically seats as well? Weird. Okay, we're fine. Guys, guys, you're blocking me off. Oh, they crashed into each other. Did I get Renegade for that? No, okay, good. I think we're done here. I don't know. I don't have to do Thane then. I was sure he was on the Citadel. Or it, oh, his loyalty mission might be on the Citadel. Hmm, I want to get Thane so that we can... Uh... You know what's good? Alliance Corsair. So I can get the, the probes. Okay, let's go back to the uh, sit uh, sit Let's go back to the uh, 
Normandy. And we'll do a quick round of talking to people and then we'll probably end it there for today. Oh wait, we haven't been everywhere yet, have we? Thinking about it. I don't know why I came all the way down here, to be honest. Also, I'm sure there's a thing about going in there as well. I don't know. Have we been everywhere? Actually, I think we have been, actually. We can't go to this place yet. Uh, and we've definitely been to all of these places now. Okay. Well, let's just go back to the... Oh, why didn't I just click go to the Normandy? What am I doing? I don't have to come back here to go to the Normandy. I said go to the Normandy, not leave the Citadel. But okay. In fact, we could do a talk to people at the beginning of the next stream. Let's start that stream off by talking to people like we did this stream. We'll probably end it here. I'll, um, I might have a look at how to get Thane, just because I want to get him as quickly as possible. It might be that we have to do some other recruiting commissions first. Oh, we can probably do research now as well. Yeah, research unlocked. So we'll do that next time as well. But anyway, um, we will end it here for today. It's been fun. I've enjoyed it. Uh, got a bit done. Did a lot of probing. <laughs> and there's a lot of more probing to come yet as well. So, um, yeah. Look forward to that. Um, we'll be back tomorrow at 8pm UK time to continue this. And um, like I said, I'm going to have a look see how you get Thane so that we can uh, try and uh, get some more probes so that probing is a lot easier. I'm going to try and like blast forward to getting Thane so we can get that. Um, but yeah, it's been fun. Thank you all for being here. And um, I'll see you all in another stream. So thank you all for being here. Thanks again and goodbye.